and baby, she gives all the feels. She gives all of those feels. The description is not lying about this fragrance right here. my channel as you all know my name is patty hence the name of the channel phenomenally patty and we are back with the sit down video i know it's been a while <laughs> but i am back with another fragrance review all right so today this fragrance discovery set that i am reviewing is by the line that is called confessions of a rebel and i first discovered this line with my scent bird subscription and the two that I have already smelled before is called Be Arch Please. <laughs> and the other one is Get a Room. When I smelled those two fragrances and I got them in my scent bird subscription, I was like, baby, I'm curious to know more. So as you all know, if you've been keeping up with my channel, I just went to Cabo for my 30th birthday. And inside of the little gift bags I got from my friends, I included these really cute little vials. It's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. It's eight. And I'm going to have the price on the screen and also down below because I currently can't remember. And they're so cute. They're like perfect for. So, this is a close up of what the individual discovery set looks like. It has a title on the front. Then when you open it up, it has a description of the fragrance and that's the cute little vial. Super, super cute. So as I mentioned, you can put these as great stocking stuffers, like for the holidays. So friends, if y'all see these again, it's a great, great gift. And they also have um, discovery sets that you can make with two or three fragrances. So whole list of options. We are gonna start them off um, and also, make sure you look at the description box because I have a little code for y'all for $25 off a full-size bottle. So, the first one is called About Last Night. It says it's a bold exclamation of scent featuring a cocktail of sparkling bergamot, pink pepper, and red grapefruit, powdery, powdery oh wow it's supposed to also include cold pressed mandarin oil and energetic spices that last from dusk till dawn i've never smelled this one before oh wow I definitely smell the powder so if you're a person that hates powder scent you know that classic deodorant baby powder type of fragrance you're not gonna like this at all because instantly when I smell this I smell that powder so it has that powdery scent for sure but it smells like a sophisticated powder if that makes sense I'm not mad at this this is like a fresh I'm lounging in the house chilling with family, kicking it in the crib, because I personally do wear a fragrance every single day, even working from home, even when I'm just relaxing, it makes me feel better about myself and my day. Okay, I'm not mad at this. I know it's not gonna be my favorite, but I'm not mad at it. The next one is called Love High. It says that it's somewhere between a lust and a lost. It has peach nectar, orange flower, jasmine. It's supposed to be shaking up <laughs> just a little bit of sweet succulent apple. Okay, it also says it includes powerful blonde woods. Everything goes, but first dive right in. So that's what we about to do. We about to dive in. That's such a cute size. Y'all know I'm a fan of little sizes you can put into your purse. Oh, I like this. This is 
a lighter fragrance. It's not super strong. So for my ladies and my gentlemen that do not like a super heavy pal fragrance that's gonna knock you out, you would really like this. It's soft, it's feminine, but still a hint of sexy. Oh, I like this. Hmm. I like that a lot. I really, I like that a lot. Okay, moving on to the next one. The next one is one I have smelled that was in my Scentbird fragrance, which is Get A Room. I know this smells good, y'all. <laughs> I love this one. Okay, it says, all heat and plenty of skin. This scent layers with mandarin, smooth woods, liquid vanilla, sage oil, and a bite of forbidden apple. We gotta do the shoulder with it. <laughs> you don't know how it will start, but you absolutely know where it is going to end, okay? This is sexy. This is very, very sexy. This is very sensual. This is date night. You going out on the town. You on vacation. You stepping out at night. It's sexy. It is very, very sexy. Honestly, if you're going on a little romantic situation, you might want to spray this on the pillows. Mm. I love this. I love this. I love this. I love this. I would wear this during the day and the night, but that's just me. Um, but it's definitely giving you that nighttime sexy type of feel. The next one is called F Mondays, okay? We all know that feeling all too well. So this one says, it's a lively citrus notes that provide an energetic jolt that you will need to crush today. Okay, it has fruity elements like peach skin and apple, but with an edge of intensity. Um, sage, sandalwood. Oh. It also includes comforting notes like suede and skin musk. Okay, y'all, let's see what this one, this one's talking about. I love the names, I love the names. Y'all know marketing is everything and the names are cute. Huh, this is definitely giving me a spring summertime fragrance. Making me think about the beach, I'm on an island somewhere. It's sweet. It's definitely sweet. I think it's a good daytime scent. But it's definitely making me think about summer, spring brunches. Oh, I like it. Oh, but it, it has like a sexy undertones to it. Mmm. I think now I'm getting that sandalwood. I am going to layer this with some things. <laughs> Y'all know I promised y'all a layering video and that it will be coming probably within the next two weeks because this right here, mm, I feel like this is going to dry down so well. It smells so good. Mm, okay, moving on to the next one, which is B Arch Please. I will have the names on the screen as we're going through this video. This one says it's an in your face. Fruit notes. Okay, it has jasmine petals. <laughs> Weaving a decadent web tingled with an element of sass, bold, brash, and unafraid to bear it all. Creamy sandalwood and skin musk. Okay, a confident kind of vibe. You know exactly who you are. <laughs> and in fact, you are the effing boss. Okay. <laughs> So I told y'all this was one that I have smelled before and baby, she gives all the feels. She gives all of those feels. The description is not lying about this fragrance right here. I love it. Oh, I love it so much. Oh, it's sweet. It does have a sweetness to it. It's not overpowering sweet, not like Bath and Body Works, I'm a young teenager, just into body sprays type of scent. She's definitely classy. 
it smells so good it does bring me more of those fall winter vibes which we are getting ready to transition to honestly today i'm probably gonna layer f mondays and be up be please that's probably what i'm gonna wear today because i got a little somewhere to be later <laughs> Okay, the next one is called Morning After. <laughs> Morning After, I'm excited to know what this one smells like. Okay, feel as good as the night before, decadent and hot. <laughs> Vibrant Italian lemon. Ooh, y'all, with lavender and patchouli and tonka bean, baby. Take on the edge, take the edge off the lingering haziness. Y'all, these claws make it look difficult to spray. I'm excited. When I saw that Tonka bean and that lavender with some patchouli, patchouli, patchouli. Sexy. This is a strong, strong fragrance. If you do not like strong scents, you will not like this. I'm gonna tell you off rip. That was what two little sprays. Ooh, she is sexy. She is powerful. She is a bold. When I'm smelling this, I'm thinking about a formal event, nighttime. Do not spray a lot of this. Do not spray a lot of this, but baby, you want to walk into a room and say a lot without saying a word? Wow, I can definitely smell like the masculinity mixed within this fragrance as well. Oh my gosh. But it's also, it smells like, oh, I'm really excited about this. It kind of smells like a bold fragrance, right? Bold, sensual, sexy, but the morning after has like, kind of like, I don't wanna say a linen undertone to it, but like, baby. Can you be clean and sexy and bold at the same time? I'm gonna have to get this one. <laughs> I'm gonna have to get this one. I'm gonna have to get that one, okay. Moving on to let's be real. Because it's all about you, authentic and in your face, with endless plush vibes and a big, bold floral heart. There's jasmine in here, tuberose, tonka bean, command your attention. While vanilla and cashmere, cashmere woods, keep the blend grounded. Let's see what she talk about. Let's be real. Wow. Oh, wow. Wow. Oh my goodness, this is, this is for a classy woman. I would spray this going into the workplace, but just a little bit. I feel like if you OD on this, people will be choking and sitting next to you, but. Wow. I feel so like posh and, and bougie and sophisticated. Dang, y'all. I like this one too. It is different. This one smells completely different than any of the fragrances I have already reviewed so far. Mm. I might be wearing this one today too. All the things, all the things. I love all the things. Okay, so this next one, the final one is called Almost Single. These names are so cute. <laughs> You're living every day like it's your last, and why not? <laughs> There's a spice of recklessness to this fragrance. Ooh, it's got black pepper in it. It's all heart and kind of hazy as rosemary and violet leaf 
rise to the surface followed by a smooth balsam and sandalwood. I'm curious. That was saying a whole lot, won't it? Ooh, I just got on my face. Jesus, don't let me break out. Let's see. Y'all, black pepper is a very, very, very strong in your face scent. And I don't think I am a fan of black pepper. When I see black pepper, I think I told y'all in a previous video, it made me think of a Kaoli fragrance and another fragrance from the, um, the Nest video. Black pepper is very distinct. And I don't know why it always makes me think about an older woman. I don't like this. I don't like this at all. 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 It makes me think about an old, rich lady in the country. Like, old money. Like she was an heiress or something, and I don't know. This this smells like a like a 78 year old old woman with money. No shade, but I would imagine the queen that just passed smelling like this. Y'all know this this one going in the trash. That's how much I like it. I wouldn't even give this to anybody. Mm -mm, I'm sorry. That's not for me. And it's almost single. You don't want. Some no. No. <laughs> okay, y'all, that concludes this video. Um, you will see some more sit down videos coming. I have a cozy conversation coming the following week after this is being posted. And I am going to get ready to do the, um, the mixing video of layering the fragrances. And also, y'all, that's another discovery set I want. I want, I want, I want, I want. <laughs> and as the holidays are coming up, fragrances are always always an amazing gift for someone all right y'all thanks so much for watching have a beautiful day i'll see y'all in another video bye